It's about 5 a.m. This guy's worn out. And this guy's worn out. It's one of the neighbor kids. They're doing a sleepover. Joseph decided he had to get back in bed with me. So, in our prayers, we've been praying about Joseph's younger brother coming home. We'll see him better from there. Little camera in my huge stomach. We're praying about that and some gas and some other things. So in a couple hours, I gotta take the neighbor upstairs to work, and he's given us just about what we asked for in our prayer. And this guy needed he needed to hang out. His family's doing some stuff, and we just he needed somebody to play with. Play a couple years younger, and we get along really good. He started calling me brother. Got to do some of my um, volunteer work at the church today. And they got to run around and play and just had a good time. Got to get some diapers for his mom. It was a really good day. It was a good kid. And this guy got to be the bigger brother today, kind of a thing. You know, to wrestle and play and teach and guide and other stuff. It was pretty good for him. You can see they're both exhausted. I gotta get a little bit more sleep. I don't, haven't slept a lot through the night. Uh, more early mornings, and I got a little bit of time for I have to go. Hope you guys are blessed, doing well, and all that. Well, you know, I'm listening to Bible studies again at night, and it's lifting me up and healing, and just my visions are appearing. My blood pressure just dropped amazingly, and. The whole sugar thing isn't doing what it's been doing. It's getting being corrected right now. It's weird. I'm just feeling these things as I'm listening and just respect, re, speaking the word with the sermon and just letting it base, letting it get inside, seeing these things come to fruit. Anyway, since he's asleep. Bye-bye.